Hey everybody, what's up? It's Kiki and welcome back for another video. Today I'm coming to give you guys all the information on this beautiful, natural looking ombre bob or lob, long bob, whichever you prefer. This is from my first wig. I have not reviewed for them in a long time, but let me tell you, the quality of their wigs are so amazing. They're beginner friendly. I mean, you can't get much beginner friendly than this. The wig did come with a lot of parting space. It is pre-plucked, it has free part. You can part the hair wherever you want. It also has this new elastic band so that you can wear it glueless. The wig did have like a brassy tone to it and I wanted to tone it just a little bit. My lighting is messing it up so you really can't tell like the difference, but trust me, it's there. So I'm just gonna take this Wella Charm T14 toner and some 20 volume developer. So you want to use a one bottle of the Wella toner and then two bottles of developer. And I actually used two bottles of the toner so I used four bottles of the developer. I'm going to mix this and apply it all over the color part of the hair. I'm taking a dye brush and applying it all over the hair and then I go in and make smaller sections and apply more of the toner and then I take a wig brush and brush the hair through just so that the toner is distributed all over the hair and then I let it sit for 30 minutes. And like I said, you really can't tell the difference in the lighting. I think it's my pink background throwing it off, but it did tone it and it's not as brassy as it was. And I am going to flat iron the hair before I apply it. That's how I've been getting a better natural look of my wigs by actually styling them on a mannequin before I apply them to my head. Because when I do it on my head, I take bigger sections. I am very lazy when it comes to it actually being on my head, but when it's on a wig stand, I actually take my time. And I did get my wig head, which is a size 22 inch circumference from Amazon as well as my two inch flat iron and then when I get to the top where the lace is just so that it can lay really really flat and natural against my head I do take some of this my first wigs flyaway tamer which is amazing I love this more than I like the cure care wax stick it doesn't leave your hair greasy or oily or sticky so I use this and then take a pressing comb and just flatten it and like I said doing it on a mannequin head makes it so much easier so you can apply a little bit more heat than you would if it was actually on your head so I'm just going to start off by doing a stocking cap method. I'm using this Fantasia Icy Spray. I think that's what it's called. It's like the old, old spray before pump it up. This was the uh, spritz that everybody used to use. And I use this because it dries really, really quick. And it also removes really, really easy. I definitely prefer this method over using the Gasta B Gel. And I am using the blow dryer on cool. And then I'm just going to cut away the excess cap. I'm going to add a little bit of foundation to my stocking cap. And then apply the wig. And I was pleasantly surprised that the wig actually melted in my head and I didn't have to glue it down. So I'm just going to lay it as is. And I was actually going to glue it down, but since the wig laid so flat against my head, I'm not gonna glue it down. I'm actually gonna wear it glueless, glueless, gelless, all that. I am gonna have to tack down the sides where my ear taps are, but other than that, I'm not going to put any glue or gel on my hair. So as you can see, this wig was very easy to install. It is very natural. The hairline is bomb because I didn't have to do anything else to it. And the outcome of the wig is just amazing, gorgeous. I love this, looks so natural. This is something I will definitely be wearing all summer. Like I said, I like styling my wig on my mannequins because look how flat my wig is. It's just bomb and I'm loving it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys check out the information for the link to my first wigs, the link to this wig, the link to any sale they're having. I believe they are having their anniversary sale, so you guys might want to check them out. And any coupon or discount codes I have will also be in the description box. I hope you guys enjoy. I love you guys, and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.